LeBron James' debut for the Los Angeles Lakers opened with two thunderous dunks and closed with a loss. He finished with 26 points and 12 rebounds, but the Portland Trail Blazers prevailed 128-119 on Thursday night, Friday, Manila time, in the season, opener for both teams. James insisted the new look Lakers were going to be a work in progress. It's not instant oatmeal. It's not that fast, James said. It takes some time to get the chemistry where you can just close your eyes and know exactly where guys are. Damian Lillard had 28 points and Nick Stauskas came off the bench to score 24 for Portland, which won its 18th straight home opener to extend an NBA record. It was the Blazers' 16th straight victory over the Lakers. The opening festivities were tempered by the death this week of Trail Blazers owner Paul Allen. A Rip City baseball cap rested in Allen's courtside seat with a single rose. The enigmatic co founder of Microsoft died on Monday in Seattle from complications of non Hodgkin's lymphoma. He was 65. There was moment of silence before the game and tributes to Allen throughout the night. On the court, the focus was all on James. His monster dunks to start stunned the Moda Center crowd, while Knight co-founder Phil Knight looked on from courtside seats. James signed a four-year, $153 million deal with the Lakers as a free agent in the offseason, after winning three NBA championship rings and taking his team, Miami and Cleveland, to the NBA Finals for each of the last eight seasons. The four-time league MVP joined a revamped group that includes veterans Rajon Rondo, Javel McGee, Lance Stevenson and Michael Beasley, as well as a young core of Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball, Kyle Kuzma, Josh Hart and rookie Mo Wagner. While the Lakers made big changes in the offseason, the Trail Blazers returned all five starters from a team that finished third in the Western Conference last season, including the nucleus of Lillard, C.J. McCollum and Joseph Nurkic. We wanted to come out and start the season right and to honor our owner, Mr. Paul Allen. That's what tonight was all about for us, not about the noise surrounding the game, Lillard said. James putback gave Los Angeles a 25-15 lead. He played just under nine minutes in the opening quarter and led all scorers with 13 points. Portland pulled in front 46-40 on Stoska's three-pointer. Stoska's, who signed with the Blazers as a free agent this past summer, led all Blazers with 16 points in the opening half. Portland pushed the lead to 11 but led just 65-63 at the break. He really got in a groove and the guy can shoot, we've seen it in practice, coach Terry Stott said about Stoskas. I was really happy for him to start the season like that with a new team. The shots that he made were all in the flow of the offense. Dot James had 18 points, but collected a third foul with 6.04 left in the half. Kuzma's dunk got the Lakers within 79 78 with just more than four minutes left in the third quarter. Hart's three pointer, the Lakers' first of the game, put Los Angeles up 85 83. The lead was short lived, but Portland had just a 93 91 advantage going into the final quarter. Stoskas hit a three-pointer that put Portland up 107-100 with 7.22 left. After it felt, he turned to the crowd and pounded his chest. McCollum's three-pointer with 5.01 left put Portland up 114-104. Caldwell Pope's three-pointer with 30. Seven seconds left got the Lakers within 124-118. But Stoskas made a pair of free throws, and Los Angeles couldn't catch up. 
tip-ins. Lakers, Lakers coach Luke Walton said Ball would continue to be on a playing time restriction after having an in procedure on his knee. Ball played 20 minutes and scored 7 points. Hart had 20 points off the bench. Los Angeles made 7 of 33 point attempts. Trailblazers, with Maurice Harkless dealing with a knee injury that bothered him in the preseason, Stotts started Jake Lehman. McCollum finished with 21 points. Honoring Allen. Oh, and the edge of the Blazers court was painted PGA with a rose, and the Blazers had similar patches on their jerseys to honor Allen. Stotts talked before the game about all the people Allen had touched. Everybody talks about his philanthropy throughout the years and what he's done. When people started writing about it and listing all the things and all his accomplishments and the impact on millions and millions of people and the environment, the earth and everything, it's hard to put into context, the magnitude, the coach said. All eyes on U.S. With James joining the team, the Lakers are certainly dealing with greater scrutiny with a huge media contingent on hand for his debut. We've talked about it, not to let it be a distraction. We're not going to let it influence what we're trying to do on this team, Walton said. In fact, we're trying to use it as something to grow a bond in our group. Our theme is to truly believe in the idea that it's just us, just us that are in here working, just us that are getting better. Up next. James will make his Lakers home debut against the Houston Rockets on Saturday, 